Okay, so now I have my uh, launch cable connected. Um, I have a 50 foot cable, very, very long. And the reason is I like to back up a little bit from the launch because sometimes the big engines do explode. It's also a little bit easier to, to watch the launch and to record it. I have this connected with this particular connector, which is used for connecting uh, tail lights on a, on a car's trailer. What's nice about this is if somebody uh, gets their feet tangled up in this cable and yanks on the controller, or just simply pull it out of the box rather than pulling the box apart and damaging it. So let's take a look at what happens under the assumption that I have my igniter wired. If I go to the launch pad and wire up the igniter, uh, basically we now have a completed circuit. Now I do not have a, an igniter in here at, right now, so let's see what's going to happen. If we turn this on, we see now the green light is on. This indicates that now we have continuity. So we have uh, several indicators. We now have power, the battery voltage is correct. The blue indicates that the breaker here is currently uh, closed and now we have continuity. So now I can turn this on and we get an interesting indication. So now we see that this is armed, the red light is on. We also hear a tone. That tone is really nice because I don't have to look at the controller to know what's going on. I know immediately if I hear tone that my launch circuit is live. So let's see what happens now if I press, press this launch button. We can see that this is a short circuit. Um, there was a tremendous surge of current that went through the wire. However, the igniter wasn't there. This is just shorted out. And the breaker protects the battery from short circuits. If you think about it, um, this particular system is going to put approximately 9 amps through this wire. A tremendous amount of current. If you do that for very long, you're going to damage your battery. So the breaker now has uh, uh, popped open, and that now has uh, prevented the um, battery from being damaged. And you can see we have to go back to the launch pad and figure out why we shorted out. So we just turn the, the uh, army switch off, turn this off, go to the launch pad and go figure out what happened.